As you can see, I'm in my dining room doing work. It's nearly 11 o'clock and I've just been doing, I mean, not really achieving very much, but I've just been looking at the taught essay questions that I've got to do. Basically, this brings me to my dilemma for the day of like what to do because there's two questions and one of them's about um, like police liability, I think um in tour um in negligence in tour so that sounds more interesting to me than the other one which is about loss of chance um and also i've just looked at loss of chance and there's not like a huge amount on it like they haven't given us any academics on it i don't think and there's only a couple of main cases so i'm thinking i should probably do the other question but that brings me to my dilemma which is i haven't done that week's content there's two weeks of content that i need to do which is like the last two weeks of term which i just haven't done which i will need to do for that so i think that's what i'm gonna have to do today is go through those two weeks worth of content and watch all of those lectures i'm gonna put you down because it's really uncomfortable and then i'll probably do the essay on that which i think is due in about a month now but yeah i thought i'd do a little bit of a vlog and that is what is on the agenda today i'm also going to go outside at some point today but i'm not sure what i'm doing yet but yeah i'm just gonna go on with doing this tour work now also if anyone was interested in what i actually chose for my modules this is the order that i put them in so gender and se gender sexuality and law was number one international commercial litigation was number two dissertation competition law international commercial arbitration I also put spanish down which is like a 30 credit module from like another course well we're allowed to do up to 30 credits of another like course with law and then company law criminal justice and commercial law which these ones are like my extras so the top six are the ones that hopefully i will get if i get all my first choices gonna go post some parcels back quickly to co-op and get some lunch while I'm there as well because I'm really hungry and then I'll get back to doing some more lectures but it's really sunny outside as well. just had some lunch and it's now quarter to two and I'm just going to try and finish the podcast for week 10 and week 11 for taught. I think there's like four more that I've got to do so yeah that's what I'm going to do for the next couple of hours. thirty now and I've just done all of those lectures. We're gonna go for a bike ride to the quay, which we will have to rent bikes for. Um and we're meeting one of my brother's friends. We just need to get changed. Don't really know what we're supposed to wear on bike rides. I've got a mask. Mask, money, phone, possibly the phone. <laughs>
good morning guys um it's just gone like half 11 i think and i've just basically been doing work in my room this morning i've come from the dining room into my room because the wi-fi is being awful and it's really cold in the dining room because it's north facing so i'm sat more in the sun in my room um and i've just got like a little fold-up desk i have been working my way through i had to choose an essay question because i was really really stuck on which one to go for for my tall essay question so i've chosen the one i think i'm pretty sure i'm gonna stick with this on police liability and negligence which i've been sort of like writing out a little bit of like a plan of like what i would probably include and what sources i want to read for it and like going through that and making sure i can find enough reading for it also i'm balancing my phone and looking in the mirror to make sure that i'm in frame because i forgot my charger for my camera batteries at uni I left at uni so I'm really annoyed about that but I ordered some extra batteries and like a charger yesterday so that should come today so I can film on my camera again but yeah on the agenda today I think I'm just going to focus on um doing readings and stuff for this tour essay I might sit outside later but I reckon I'll probably be too cold even though it's really sunny yeah and later on I'm meeting my friend for a walk so I'm very excited for that um we're going for a walk this evening I'm not sure where probably the beach and yeah that's the agenda today I think I need to do my nails as well because I've started picking them off. I will keep you updated on the rest of the day. just done my nails while watching some youtube videos and i am going to make some noodles with i think just pepper might put an egg in there and do like egg fried noodles while i listen to some like news politics updates yeah and then i think i might go for a run in a little bit while waiting on a hello fresh order because i had like a free box so i might need to be in for that if my mum's not back for my run and I've been doing the couch to 5k thing for quite a long time because I took a massive break in the middle and like I'm really not a good runner like at all like I can't really breathe and it hurts my chest quite a lot but I just ran for 20 minutes without stopping because that's where I got up to on the plan and yeah pretty cool for me I know it's literally like most people could do that with their eyes shut but I'm really not a good runner so it's a big win for me today and also it's gorgeous outside as you can see so it was nice to get out as well i've completely forgotten to film but i've had some dinner and it's nearly seven o'clock ish i think so i'm just about to head off to meet my friend and we're gonna go watch the sunset down at the beach i think which should be really nice i'm really looking forward to seeing her so it should be nice and it's still really nice weather and the sunset's so pretty over there <laughs> now and I was supposed to get up early this morning and like get on with a load of work 
um, and just have like a full work day, but I have not done that. I went to M&S this morning with my mum to pick up bits for Easter and get a present for my friend. I've basically just been editing this vlog for a couple of hours. I'm probably gonna try and do a little bit of reading later, maybe try and finish the chapter that I started for taught or depending on how I feel I might just leave it and try and do like a day's work tomorrow before the bank holiday weekend and just get some work done tomorrow but basically I'm just really really not feeling it like just don't want to do it um at the moment and I think getting started is like one of the hardest parts getting started with revision and essay writing like because I really don't want to do it at the moment but I feel like when you've got started and you know exactly what you've got to do and when you know like what direction you're going in for everything it's a little bit easier but because I haven't got like properly into everything yet I'm just not there yet and also the fact that my exams are like a little bit later than they were because they've moved them back um I know that I have like a good week between my exams like when my essays are due and then my exams so that's like a whole free week to revise and obviously that open book so yeah I do like I know I have a lot of work to do but I think subconsciously because I know that these few days like me having these few days of not really doing as much work won't have like a big impact like I will still be able to do everything fingers crossed like I think I know that subconsciously which is why I'm not feeling that motivated that and the fact that I haven't properly started yet but yeah I will get there and it's fine to have unmotivated days it's all about discipline as well isn't it because realistically we can't be motivated all the time and I don't actually want to revise all the time it's just that I get into a schedule where I just do work every weekday and then have the weekends off so I will get into the swing a bit soon so I'm gonna sign off here and stop filming now so I really really hope you've enjoyed the video it's been really nice to be home obviously I'm home for Easter which is allowed with the restrictions I am allowed to be home. Thank you so much for watching, I really hope you've enjoyed and I will see you in the next video. Mm -hmm.